Welcome or uh, welcome back on GeoGebra. In this video clip, we're gonna talk about constructing an angle by sector. So again, I'm gonna click on this app, Geometry. Uh, okay, and I'm gonna construct an angle. So two rays, one ray, the second one. Okay, and now we're gonna construct the angle bisector for this angle. I can take any of these two gentlemen, these two circle. Okay, let's mark the other point also. As you see, this circle is creating two intersection points on one on each ray. Okay. Uh, now we have no choice. We have to pick the other circle from here, the one that uh, we need to put the radius. So I'm going to click here. I'm going to put the center of the circle here and let's give a radius of uh, 5, I guess. And the same here, the same uh, construction here. And as you notice, we do have an intersection point. Right here. And this uh, ray that I'm going to construct now, starts from A, goes through F, is the angle by sector of the original angle, if you remember, of the angle BAC. Uh, let's see if I can clean a little bit the uh, uh, object here something else first uh, let's see if we can uh, hide that object okay looks like it's good so again one more time this ray AF is the angle bisector of angle BAC well, let's double check that we can do that by uh, using a GeoGebra tool that measure angles is uh, it is right here we're gonna measure the angle BAF that one looks like 25.9 and we're gonna measure the other angle F A C okay and as you notice they have the same measure that is about constructing an angle bisector using GeoGebra if you enjoy this video clip please click the like button and come back on C squared thank you and have a great day